friends, welcome to another Kid Zone with Miss Trishy. Today we're doing an art project on trees, autumn trees, fall trees. Have you noticed that the trees have been turning different colors? They've been turning what colors? Red, <gasps> yellow, and then they, they've been green, but then they turn color. So some of them are still green, brown, yeah. You guys are smart. So, and they've been falling. So we're gonna print with, you know what this is? Broccoli, that's what this is. It's called broccoli, it's a vegetable. And some of you might call it a little tree because it looks like a little tree, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So I took a little piece from it already. So we're gonna use little pieces to do printing on paper to make a special project do you know what we're making? We're making fall trees and we're gonna use the broccoli. Do you guys like broccoli? Do you eat broccoli? I love broccoli. I boil it and put olive oil on it. How do you eat your broccoli? Do you put cheese on it? Some of you probably put cheese on it. Some of you eat it with your chicken or chicken nuggets, right? It's very delicious, so I love my broccoli. But since this one was getting a little old, I decided to make a project with it. Come on, let's go. Friends, these are the things we're gonna need. First, we're gonna need our broccoli. Then we're gonna need some paint colors. You could do any colored paints you want. I'm gonna do red. I'm gonna do yellow, some green, and I'm also gonna do some brown that I have in this little tube a brown color. So that's the color. And then you're gonna need a paintbrush, any kind of paintbrush. This is my paintbrush that I'm gonna be using. It's a little one. And a container to put your paint in. And some paper. Don't forget your beautiful art paper. All right, let's get to it. First thing we're gonna do, friends, is we're gonna use brown. And we're gonna use that to make the tree trunk right here. And you don't have to make a fancy tree trunk, just whatever you like. And I'm gonna start mine right now. You ready? Let's go. I'm gonna dip my brush in my paint. And I'm gonna make a tree trunk, just like this. You guys can make a little one, a thick one, whatever you like. See that? You could even put a little hole here in your tree trunk if you like for the little squirrels to come in. And then you could paint the inside of your tree trunk. So now it's time to pour our colors into our container. Which color should we use? We have brown already. Which color should we use? We have brown already. B, R, O, W, N spells brown. So which one should we do first? Red, green, or yellow? I think we should do red. So we'll do red first. Red. Pour it into our container. We're going to pour it into our container. Red. Spell. We're going to pour it into our container. We're going to do red. R E D. 
red. Which color should we do next? Yellow or green? Hmm. I'm going to do, gr I'm going to do, I'm sorry, I'm going to do yellow. 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 Y E L L O W. Yellow. Yellow has two L's in it. Which color is next? That's right, green. Green is next. Green, G, R, E, E, N. Green. Green has two E's in it. That's right, my friends. Now, how many colors do we have? We have one, two, three, Four, four colors. We have four colors to use. You could put more colors if you like. You could put any colors you like. So now let's get started with our broccoli fall tree printing. So we're going to take our piece of broccoli that looks like a little tree. See how mine started turning yellow? because it's getting older. So now we're gonna use, we're gonna hold it by the stem so we don't get our fingers dirty, or we're gonna try not to get our fingers dirty. But if you do, that's okay. You can wash them after. We're gonna take it and we're gonna dip it in the colors we like. We can mix the colors, or we could just do one color at a time. Let's do red. Oops, there it goes. Look at that. You just go up and down to do your leaves. <gasps> See that? You could do a lot of paint or just a little paint to make them look like fall leaves. I'm gonna do yellow. You could use a sit. Oh my goodness, my kitty cat <gasps> is walking on my paint. I have to take him off. Oh no, we're gonna have to wash her paw now. Oh no, Nene, you want to do some painting too? Hold on, my friends. Whew, thank you for coming back, my friends. I had to wash the, our cat Nene's paws. She got red paint on it. All right, let's finish our art project. Let's go. I think I'm gonna make some leaves falling down the tree now. Do you want to make some leaves falling down the tree? like they do for real, like they do in the fall. Adapt some more. I'll make some leaves falling down the tree. Oh, look at that. Make them falling down. And you could put some on the ground also. Look at that. Leaves on the ground. Do you see leaves on the ground? You do. You can make a pile of leaves. That a pile of leaves going up a big pile of leaves. <gasps> Look at that. Don't forget to clean up when you're done. Have mom and dad help you if you need help. Throw your broccoli in the trash. Wash your little paint container in the sink. And your brush also. Good job. Wash it in the sink. All clean. Now you could dry it with your cloth. All clean. 
We're gonna let it dry and then put it away.